Hello, this is Work Life from BBC News with Ben Bland and Tim Wilcox. Now, protecting your children online in a world where most seven-year-olds already own a phone, online safety is becoming a big concern for parents and authorities around the world. We're live and in London. That's our top story on Tuesday, the 4th of February. Fifty percent of the UK's ten-year-olds owned a smartphone in 2019, according to a report by the media regulator Ofcom. Also, Tesla is now the world's second most valuable car company after Toyota. Shares rose after reports said the electric car firm was undervalued. And the UK's aviation industry is promising to reduce its net carbon emissions to zero by the year 2050. Also, we'll be getting the uh, inside track on books for schools that aim to break the stigma and raise awareness of autism and special educational needs through education. Also today, we want to know your thoughts. So how do you limit the amount of time children and young people spend on smartphones? Or is it just part now of growing up in the 21st century? Tell us what you think. Hashtag BBC Work Life. Hello and a very warm welcome to Work Life. A lot of you getting in touch on Twitter about that, differing views on whether you should even be trying to limit the technology or whether it actually helps children prepare for the skills they need in the workplace. We'll come to those responses a little later. But we start with uh, advances in technology and the internet have, for the most part, made our lives easier. For parents, though, uh, as we mentioned, it brings a whole new set of concerns. According to the UK regulator Ofcom, more parents than ever feel that children's online use now carries more risks than it does benefits. And it seems that it's becoming harder to avoid. Let me explain. Last year, Ofcom found that half of UK 10-year-olds now own their own smartphone, mainly as they're preparing for secondary school. And they're now more likely than ever to see hateful content online. Half of 12 to 15-year-olds had seen hateful content within the last year. That's an increase uh, from 34% back in 2016. Parents are also concerned about a rise in online gaming. More 5 to 15-year-olds are playing games online than ever before. Tim. So, uh, Liat Hughes-Josh is a journalist, commentator, has written a number of books on uh, parenting and with 